Welcome back again to the channel. I know I promised you two guests, but I'm back again with another one because we're all about surprises. So we discovered that another talent along the way. We're like, you know what, we gotta introduce these guys to the channel. We gotta just infuse them into this, you know. On the left of me is the gentleman here next to me. He's about to deliver a poem, performance type of thing. You know, we're all about creativity. On, let me just get, like, head over to him. So, what guy is that? Shop is it? Shop, shop. Eh, come on, Jason, for the you man. What is Ah, you're so good, Thomas. I'm so glad. Fine, I'm here to do a poem. If a man could get pregnant, Black sister, you will be a king. If a man could get pregnant, success would be responsibilities and other. Call a man. If a man could get pregnant, purity would be the big nature and pain would be their mind. If a man could get pregnant, men and child abuse would be their black king. 50-50. Go and buy a knife so I can hold this sharp plate like an African woman. Then I just knew that she would fight for the throne. When? When will they proceed with the session? Because women are not allowed and the wisdom is needed. She is the man. The law gave him two women. She left the bird when they go to sleep. This African love is straight. No one will pray. Homo homo. When will they adopt the next generation before the sunset? Queens. Yes, queens. There were queens once upon a time. There are two kings in the castle of life. Their forces we hate the most. Sometimes they kill and cry, the dead are guilty. They say as their body lay, quiet the left us, but they so more in anguish. Why? Why did you choose to die before the law? All had rights, but those rights faded away as men matured in law, given to him by force. We apologize for doing nothing wrong, says the law man. Valentine's is not the real thing. But love us still, we have both sex me to celebrate each other's intimates. It is the day we love each other. If a man could get pregnant like a sea horse, they will run and come back like a boomerang, and there will be no court and maintenance. Boomerang. Thank you, Mr. Thomas, for that interesting poem. I mean, it's a very moving poem. It gives you a different perspective on like how women and men are treated or how the figure of man is, is labeled in the country. And that, that for me is quite like educator. I mean, even the viewers back home can see that men are not always entitled to that masculinity as how people should see it. But women too deserve to be at the same level as men. And if men were to transition into women, how would we handle that? And for, for, for you to come through for us and actually perform that, that was very, very heartwarming for us. And we thank you so much for that. That was great. Yeah. Yeah, no, thank you, thank you for the opportunity and thank you for letting me perform this prayer to also send a powerful message. And this is also go to all gender based violence that is happening in South Africa, so it's a powerful message. Um or send advice. So you know how we do with my choosing media projects, you all know about that anyway. Catch and me also, also also oh. catch me on Itemba where I've been playing Petri. It's the series with the episodes. I hope you enjoy. Same channel, much as Camilla Project. Have